Hey, hey, I am Jo Ellen, and I'm gonna show you a really cool trick on how to get fuller lips without lip injections. So keep watching. All right, if you were blessed with nice, full, plump lips, then you don't need to watch this. But if you're like me, and you have thin lips, or they're getting smaller with age, then this will be a great tr trick to use in your makeup routine to get those fuller lips without having to do any injections or surgeries or anything. It's just easy, simple thing you can add to your makeup routine, okay? So what you need for this look is a lip brush and some contour and a lip color, any lip color that you want. So get those things out and I'll show you how you can get those fuller lips so easily, all right? So I'm using this lip brush and using the same exact contour that I'd be using for my face. So if I contoured my cheekbones, my forehead, my nose, all the things, same exact contour I'm gonna be using on my lips. So I'm just taking my brush and dipping it into my contour color. And now I'm gonna be um, lining the outside of my lips. I'm gonna create a, a line and um, a shadow that will help them look fuller. So you, you'll see how cool this is, all right? And you might be thinking like, Joellen, <laughs> I don't want to look crazy like back in the 90s when you had those uh, that crazy stark line of a lip liner, right? We're not going for that look. Don't worry. We're just creating a shadow and then we're going to fill in our lips with our lip color. So don't be afraid. We can do this. All right. So get your, your, um, your brush and your contour and you're going to be following right along your lip line. Now you can even go... So see, I have, um, my, my coloring is kind of fading on the edge of my, of my lip line. And so you can follow like right along that or even go a little bit beyond it to make them look a little bit larger. So just follow that lip line. And you see already how I've created that shadow and they're looking plumper. I didn't do anything. You didn't see me put any injections in it. You didn't see me put any like plumping lotions or anything on. This is just a brush and contour, that's it. So do the same thing on the top. Follow that lip um, coloring of your, the outer edge of your lip. Okay. And if you feel like you are, it's just too much, then do a little bit less or um, do it not so far off your lip color. Just do what you feel is comfortable and then you can work and play around with it, okay? So now I have my, my lips lined. If you wanna add more, you can. That's, that's the beauty about makeup and your beauty routine is that you can just play around with it until you get the right look. So if you're doing it exactly the same way that I'm doing it and it's just not working for you, that's okay. Play around with it until you feel like it works good for you. So if you want to stay within your lip color, that's fine. If you want to go out onto your um, onto your skin color, try that. So just kind of play around with it until you get the look that makes you look and feel your best. All right. So now I have just created that shadow and that dimension around my my lips. And now I'm gonna go in with any lip color that you have. So if you wanna go for like an everyday lip color, if you wanna use a pink color, a bright bold color, peachy color, whatever you, you want, it doesn't matter. But just use whatever lip color you want and fill in your lips now so you don't have that stark contrast. Right now, it doesn't really actually doesn't even look that bad. But we don't wanna go for, the, we don't wanna like teeter on the edge of the 90s look. We wanna make it look as natural as possible. So we're gonna fill in our lips with a color. I'm gonna go for like an everyday color. I'm going to go for this one right here. This is a natural everyday gloss. But if you wanted to do bolder, you could go bold girl. So fill in those lips. And if you want to smudge the line a little bit so that it appears as natural as possible, you totally can. And there I have, you can kind of clean up any edges if you want to feel like you kind of went outside the borders or it was a little bit messy, totally fine. Just clean up your edges. And there I have fuller lips. I didn't invest in any extra products. I didn't invest in any injections, any plumpers, nothing like that. 
just already what I had in my makeup bag, some contour, lip color, my brush, that's it. That's so cool that you can use what you have, the versatile um, colors that you already have in your compact and use them for other things. So give that a try and let me know how it goes. It's a fun little trick that will just kind of take your makeup game up a notch. We'll kind of give you a little bit fuller, plumper, sassier lips um, without having to do anything else. Crazy, right? So please comment below and tell me how it goes for you. So if you need any recommendations on what lip colors or contour colors would be great for you and your skin coloring, comment below and I will be happy to get back to you. But make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss any other great, simple beauty tips and tricks. Um, and make sure to take good care of yourself so you feel good and you can do good. Ciao.